Well, welcome back. Some scattered snow showers across the region earlier today. Some light accumulations up towards the Finger Lakes uh, between one and three inches uh, accumulated as that front passed through ushering in the colder temperatures. We're heading down to near zero for a low tonight. So some pretty chilly stuff and wind chill values will be uh, close to 10 to even as low as 15 degrees below zero through the first half of the night. And then the winds will tend to diminish a bit uh, uh, as we go after midnight and towards daybreak. Warming trend begins tomorrow. Uh, we start out in the single digits, but we head up through the 20s during the day and actually we'll continue to push those temperatures up tomorrow night. And uh, by Sunday, we'll be looking at high temperatures right around 40. And by then, some mixed rain and snow showers uh, scattered about the area as another front heads our way. 21 in Corning, 18 in Watkins Glen, 19 in Elmira, 14 the current temperature over in Sayre, and 21 right now in Tawanda, 16 the current temperature up in Penyon. So the cold front that passed through earlier today now slicing through areas of Pennsylvania. Some snow showers pushing off towards the south with it, but in its wake, temperatures continue to tumble and our skies at least partially clearing out. You can see that on the satellite map here, looking at a clearing trend, and that will continue here as we go through the overnight period. Although with the colder temperatures pushing across Lake Ontario, uh, we may see some scattered clouds up towards uh, the Tompkins County area, but otherwise uh, mainly clear skies expected. 19 Elmira, 15 in Bradford and Altoona coming in. Uh, with temperatures right around 30 factor in the winds. It's feeling like five below already in Binghamton, nine above the current wind chill value in Elmira. 24 hour planner showing the clear skies, quiet weather conditions tonight down to around zero. And then for tomorrow, we'll be looking at sunshine giving way to just some fair weather clouds for the afternoon. Temperatures actually will continue to rise up through the 20s and get close to 30 as we go through the overnight period tomorrow night. So uh, kind of a backwards temperature trend tomorrow. Temperatures won't drop off, but continue to rise through the overnight period. Future track here for our Saturday looking pretty quiet weather wise, just some scattered clouds for the afternoon. And then at night clouds will thicken. Temperatures continue to rise and by Sunday some mixed rain or snow showers here and there. Generally light precipitation though, and then some flurries and lingering snow showers as we go through Sunday night. On the back side of the cold front, temperatures start to drop off just a little bit. Five degree guarantee for today. We forecast a high temperature of 26. We hit 31 earlier today, but ever since then, temperatures continue to drop off. Look for single digits both above and below zero for the northern tier tonight. Up into the southern tier, Elmira forecasting a low of zero, one below in Bath and one below in Spencer. And for the southern Finger Lakes, clear skies as well. And temperatures around two in Penyan. One is what we're forecasting in the Glen. First warning, seven day forecast showing rain and snow showers here and there on Sunday. Maybe a lingering flurry for Martin Luther King Jr. Day on Monday. Notice temperatures next week kind of holding steady upper 20s to around 30 degrees. So not a whole lot of temperature movement after we get uh, past Sunday. Sunday, our warmest day by far with highs around 40. It's wonderful. It's gonna, it looks like it's going to be a good weekend. Not bad. Tomorrow, more sun, but uh, we'll trade off the clouds on Sunday, but push the temperatures up. Wonderful. All right. Thank you so much, Joe.